Yesterday afternoon we were contacted uh, by a concerned member of the community who hadn't seen an occupant over on Maclay Island for a while and uh, asked us to go and do a welfare check and uh, our officers have gone round uh, to an address at LST Court on Maclay Island and uh, unfortunately found an 85 year old woman deceased in her own home there. Under the circumstances that she was found, we're a bit concerned in relation to uh, the incident, so we're conducting a full investigation in relation to it. And being an island community like that, we're seeking the assistance of members of the public to see if anyone has seen or heard anything on the island in and around Ellistair Court uh, during uh, Monday and Tuesday. Uh, we're not really going into the injuries at this stage. We're still uh, in the process of uh, examining the scene, examining uh, her and uh, conducting our inquiries. Whereabouts in the house was she found? Uh, she's found in the bedroom of her house, yes. I heard that there's blood in the room. Uh, we're just still conducting inquiries in relation to uh, how she was found and the circumstances of it. We're just not looking to go into the, the details of any incidents such as that. Does there appear to have been any type of home invasion or could this have been a robbery gone wrong, for example? Well, we're keeping an open focus at this stage. Uh, we're forensically examining the entirety of the house and we're trying to seek as much information from members of the public who may have seen anything or heard anything, particularly in a small community like that, where uh, we can hope that the members of the public can come and help us and find out what has happened. When was the last she was seen? Uh, she was seen on Monday afternoon and uh, that's where, uh, when a member of the community hasn't been able to get hold of her, they've contacted us and we've made the, the discovery. Do you know much about um, the woman's um, being 85, about her physical condition, whether she was she would have been able to, to put up a bit of a fight with someone? Uh, it's hard to say. She's 85 years of age and living on her own um, and it appeared to be in, in good health. So uh, that's why we're sort of treating the matter. Uh, it's part of the raising of the concern. She was healthy at that stage and uh, she's now um, deceased and we're looking as to how that's occurred. What about neighbours? It seems like a pretty quiet, close-knit have they been able to tell you anything about anything they saw that was suspicious? Well, that's, that's one thing. Uh, we're, we're canvassing all the neighbours, uh, canvassing as many members of the island communities we can to sort of see if uh, they've noticed any comings or goings or heard or seen anything, and that's part of the public appeal. If you, if you live on that island or know anything that's happened, please either contact your local police station or Crime Stoppers on 1800 333 000. And have there been a lot of break-ins on the island? Uh, nothing that's really jumped out of the ordinary. Uh, crime happens all across, across the state everywhere, so there's, nothing, there's no spikes or anything that's sort of telltale uh, indicating that there's anything uh, wrong in that regard. Okay, you, I'm, I'm guessing you guys are obviously concerned given that um, um, I suppose an 85-year-old woman perhaps wouldn't normally be considered a suspicious death, but is there something that has led you guys to believe? Well, just in, just in the uh, general circumstances of the matter, as you say, an 85-year-old woman's been found on the floor of her bedroom uh, under circumstances that we're, we're uh, looking to see what has actually got going on in that, uh, in that house. Does it seem like any furniture or, or belongings were disturbed or, or stolen? Uh, she lives on her own in the house and uh, it's a, a full size house so we're going to take quite a while to forensically examine all the furniture, all the, uh, the trappings inside the house to see if there's any indication of any, uh, anything untoward. So what sparked your interest of whether this could be suspicious or not? Well, it's one of those circumstances where she's found uh, under, under unnatural circumstances, deceased in her own house and uh, there was no real uh, reason for ill health or anything like that, so that's what's caused our uh, suspicions and we're treating it uh, accordingly. And what about the condition of the body? Is, does she have any injuries at all? Uh, I'm unable to go into any uh, details of any uh, condition of the body at this stage. And the family's been notified obviously? Yes, the family been notified and obviously traumatised as you can imagine. Um, uh, we've got a lovely 85 year old grandmother living on Maclay Island and, and she's passed away under suspicious circumstances and, and we're really keen for any public assistance that we can get to help us uh, solve what's going on. Was she active in the community or was she rather active? She's, she's fairly mobile uh, and uh, well known amongst the community there and uh, it's a tragic loss to, to the whole island community. How long has she been living on the island? Uh, she's been there for a number of years uh, in, in her own house there uh, since her husband passed away some, some years ago and uh, she's well known amongst the people there and well respected. And are you guys still waiting for forensic tests and that sort of thing before you can... 
We will be uh, waiting for forensic tests, both uh, medical as well as uh, forensic examination of the scene. And the scene's going to take quite a considerable period of time because it's a, it's a whole house. It's not just a one small crime scene per se. Uh, you don't want to. You don't get a second chance. You don't get a chance to go back. So we're going to fully, fully examine the scene and uh, look at all aspects of it. How long? Uh, it won't surprise me if we have the crime scene for a number of days just to make sure that we don't miss anything and that we conduct a thorough examination of uh, every piece of evidence that's available to us. Anything else you want to add? Uh, if I can, uh, this is, uh, has been a crime where we've got an 85-year-old grandmother died under suspicious circumstances. Uh, we need the public's help. It's as simple as that. If you have seen anything suspicious on Monday or Tuesday over in Mackay Island in and around Alistair Court, uh, don't, don't be afraid. Come forward. Either come forward to your local police or Crime Stoppers on 1800 333 000 and help us find out what's going on.